there. Welcome to Apple World you host gatherings. In any case, I was more similar to simply attempting to flow, as you can see where I look. Think back on where I was. However, did you miss me? Seriously? Since we. I'm saying it appears to be a thing. That is to say, just a birthday celebration, man. However, I'm discussing it for your birthday. Is there any valid reason why you won't party with me for your birthday, man? Definitely, we party for my birthday before you came to my party. No, however, me and you ain't never truly parties. You understand what I'm talking about. It's so astounding that I'm at last spilling the tea on what occurred after Diddy requested that he'd party with him. Also, better believe it, it seems as though Diddy's never beating those claims after this. Since Diddy showed up on that scandalous beverage winner's episode, marvelous bits of gossip have been twirling around that Diddy attempted to take action on, inspiring him to go to one of his reputed men's just gatherings. Indeed, it just so happens that breathtaking wound up celebrating with Diddy all things considered. Notwithstanding, he could have done without what he saw there and uncovered that he needed to behave like he was going to the restroom and afterward took off when Diddy wasn't watching. Furthermore, as insane as this sounds, Breathtaking isn't the main rapper who has wild stories to share from Diddy's gatherings. Cameron recently guaranteed that he tracked down a grown-up toy at Diddy's home. And all the more as of late, the sweetheart of Osiris guaranteed she got with a man not long after he started bits of gossip that he's Diddy's mysterious Don Juan. Furthermore, I went to utilize the restroom, and there was a dildo on the restroom sink. Furthermore, when I emerged, I asked him, shouldn't something be said about what he likes? That is the homeboy's joint. You know, I don't have the foggiest idea what's going on with it. Yet what did Breathtaking say regarding Diddy's gatherings? What precisely did he see there that made him need to take off? We should get into it. Goodness, no, my sibling goodness, man. Man. Yo, it's Furrow here. Definitely, better believe it, no doubt, definitely, no doubt. Better believe it. To you. Charm. Happy birthday to you. Charm. Tales about Diddy tossing gay gatherings have indeed re-emerged after reports emerged that Diddy and Jamie Foxx used to arrange stripped b-ball competitions with other industry men. One TikTok client as of late became a web sensation subsequent to guaranteeing that her mother, who was companions with Jamie some time ago, educated her regarding Jamie facilitating stripped b-ball games with different men. I simply have these things called butt-exposed ball games, all right? He would welcome over a ton of Hollywood's world-class athletes to his home for a ball game. Yet it was men, as it were. Furthermore, they would be like, Glory, we're about to get stripped and play b-ball. Like, goodness, huh, we should get stripped and play b-ball together. Which is bizarre. As per this TikToker, Diddy was likewise supposedly a standard at these gatherings, along with numerous other high-profile industry men. A great deal of your number one vips were there, including somebody who could conceivably have been hitched to somebody who was drinking that lemonade. However, in the meantime, a meeting with Jamie on Howard Harsh re-emerged where he really owned up to playing exposed b-ball in spite of the fact that he minimized it, asserting it occurred at the ocean side. Shouldn't something be said about those photos that appeared? Why didn't you have a few pictures of you playing stripped ball? I realize it wasn't so much that we were near the ocean or something to that effect. I don't have the foggiest idea. It was youthful in my profession. Nonetheless, after Jamie later offered a few stigmatizing remarks about Howard's co-have, Robin quivers, Howard chose to put Jamie on impact, Guarantee Jamie swings both ways, and come in here and let me know how unessential I am. Come here one man to another and converse with me in the event that you truly have a bug up your butt about me and we're in the same boat. My speculation is that we're presumably not in the same boat. I believe he's playing for an alternate group. So after Jamie was as of late hospitalized, tales began zooming around that Diddy attempted to quiet Jamie in light of the fact that he realized a lot about those exposed basketball games. In the interim, rapper YK Osiris, who recently started spreading bits of gossip about being Diddy's mysterious darling, got uncovered by his ex for going behind her back with another man. Kay, who's 29 years younger than Diddy, supposedly went on an excursion with Diddy to Jamaica, which ignited hypotheses that he's Diddy's mysterious Don Juan. So when Kay showed up on the morning meal club, you definitely realized Charlemagne needed to get some information about these reports. 
and keeping in mind that Kay denied he went to Jamaica alone with Diddy, for reasons unknown, he was unable to quit grinning. While Charlemagne was perusing newspaper tales about his supposed excursion with Diddy, in the wake of perceiving how YK got all anxious when he got some information about Diddy, fans leaped to the remarks to say his nonverbal communication doesn't lie, with his facial response and nonverbal communication affirming it. One fan said, It is so obvious. He's in a real sense feeling it under his skin and is uncomfortable, like being cornered. He nearly left. Anxious, blameworthy. He couldn't actually look at them without flinching, and his hands were everywhere. I don't have the foggiest idea what to do. Claiming to be occupied like it doesn't have anything to do with discussion and don't have any desire to be important for it. Furthermore, another fan added, he seems to be Diddy's sword as well. He wants media preparation with the goal that he can figure out how to lie on the spot and get the current week's X. Natasha Thomas has as of late dropped a stunner on Instagram after fans constrained her to uncover why she and Kay split up. Quit asking me what occurred with my child's daddy, Natasha. I got him from a man. Okay, yet yeah, why? Osiris isn't the main person. Diddy supposedly went on heartfelt outings. There's likewise Sway Lee, who went on an outing to the Bahamas with Diddy two or three years ago. Furthermore, Diddy even set up Sway to get a hairstyle near the ocean. Furthermore, you definitely realize fans rushed to expect that Sway was Diddy's new Don Juan Diddy and his bae. One fan remarked, We're going to express congrats to Sway Lee in brief when he brings forth Diddy's child, and another fan said he took him to the goods Desperado Oceanside House Central Command. And afterward, we likewise can't disregard Ja Rule Diddy's reputed friend with benefit. From some time ago, Diddy's previous protector, Jean Dial, guaranteed that he stood monitor while Diddy and Ja Rule were getting going in a lodging. What's more, this happened the very day Jean went with Diddy to get some grown-up toys. And afterward, he picked like many of them down. I'm like, okay. He took care of them. So when I went by there and I looked into there and it said butt fittings and like, hello yo, Puff and Ja Rule runs out the room. Puff got his towel, John got his towel. However, they brought the exposed. He just looked. Puff checked John out. He said, Yo, John said you don't have any desire to go in that room since there's a ton of freaky stuff going on. Nonetheless, not all rappers were down to party with Diddy, and obviously one of them is awesome. As of late, it has been uncovered that he hit up one of Diddy's gatherings, thinking it was only a standard occasion. In any case, when he saw what was happening there, he needed to escape before Diddy saw him. So you most likely recall how Back in 2017, Diddy crashed a beverage winner's interview with Fantastic and Jadakiss. What's more, when Fantastic was discussing the way in which he enjoyed his birthday with his children, Diddy interfered with him to inquire as to whether he missed being with him on that day. I will host a gathering, and we hosted get-togethers. However, I was more similar to simply attempting to flow, as you can see where I look. Think back on where I was. However, did you miss me? Without a doubt? Since we, I'm saying it appears to be a thing. It's this birthday celebration, man. Diddy then constrained a spectacular to answer why they never celebrated together. Furthermore, poor impressive looks so awkward that for the remainder of the meeting, he continued to gaze at his plate and didn't actually need to look Diddy directly in the eyes. Man, I'm discussing it for your birthday, huh? Is there any valid reason why you won't party with me for your birthday, man? We partied for my birthday before you came to my party. No, yet me and you are rarely truly celebrated. You understand what I'm talking about. Coincidentally, during a similar meeting, Diddy alluded to Nori as daddy a few times and, surprisingly, made him blow the birthday cakes. Better believe it. I love this beverage with my sack. I like it when you like this. Daddy, will you move my sack? Daddy, I like when you while you scramble and scratch for. That's what I like. Yet, did Remarkable at any point take up Diddy's proposal to party? Party? Indeed, astonishing as of late uncovered that he went to one of Diddy's gatherings. Notwithstanding, as the night went on, he understood that things were getting excessively wild. So he wound up escaping by imagining he needed to utilize the restroom. I told Diddy I was going to the restroom and slid. At any point when it was 7A. N. Impressive composed on his IG stories, and in another story, Awesome asked his supporters, 
Do you get peer compelled into going to the afters? You truly need to return home or back to the room, yet you would rather not go down to turn up. Another inquiry. You at any point said you were going to the restroom and left, and keeping in mind that breathtaking Common has no subtleties about what precisely he saw at Diddy's party, fans have thoughts of their own. Puffy begins drinking, and the genuine Puffy emerges out of the storeroom, one fan said. What's more, someone else added, assuming you nodded off at Diddy's home, you weren't exactly even drained. Furthermore, assuming you end up awakening, he will be on your back.